Well, reaching temps of over negative 300 degrees, liquid nitrogen can freeze something in a matter of seconds. And that's the idea behind a unique ice cream shop in Macomb County. April Morton went by the family business to show us how they're whipping up the sweet treats. Ice cream made from scratch. They're doing it here in Sterling Heights at Frisquia. And joining me is one of the co-owners, Jessica Samakai. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I am great. <laughs> so this is so cool. And you're going to actually show us the process. But first, tell me exactly, um, what do you offer here? We offer um, liquid nitrogen ice cream. Okay. We also have like soft serve, regular hard scoop, gelato, milkshakes, smoothies. I love it. So you said this is all made from scratch. Yes. So talk to me, what exactly is the process? So now we have our special base. We have different flavors like vanilla, chocolate, strawberry, pistachio, any kind. Mm -hmm. And so you could do many flavors, like many ice creams with this vanilla flavor, but mm -hmm. today we're going to do Oreo. Oh, I love Oreo. <laughs> all right, exciting. Okay, so um, so tell me exactly, so you went and got the nitrogen from the, the huge machine over here. <laughs> so tell me, like, how, how what does that do for the ice cream exactly? So the liquid nitrogen uh, will freeze the base, so it turns into ice cream consistency, mm -hmm. so I can scoop it. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, so um, let's see, what do, we, what do we have here? What are we doing first? All right, so here's the liquid. So we're just gonna put it into this. This will go into our mixer. And then we have our topping, so we're going to have Oreos inside. And now we're going to start freezing it. So we're going to mix this. And so you're adding the liquid nitrogen, nitrogen. and yes. that's going to freeze it. Yes, and add it very slowly or else it will freeze a lot. That's pretty cool. So how long does this process usually take? It takes around like 40 seconds to a minute, depends on what ice cream you get. So how do you know when it's ready? Since I've been working for a while now, I think I could just hear it. Mm -hmm. So it's like now it's ready. Okay, so you kind of get like a freeze sound. Yeah. Like I can hear it literally freezing. Yeah. Oh, look at that. So this is like, is this like a vanilla flavor? Yeah, it's vanilla with Oreos and it's called cookies and cream on our menu. Oh yeah, I can see it, you know, nice and formed. That's pretty cool. So can I put the toppings on? That'll be yes. just so exciting. Here's right. the Oreo. So do I just crumble it up? You or? do one Oreo on top. Okay. Just kind of. Just like that, yeah. All right, so homemade ice cream. This, oh my gosh, is so nice and solid. I love the texture of it. That's delicious, Jessica. It's really good. It is really good. <laughs> like, seriously, it's really good. <laughs> I can taste the love that went into this. <laughs> so give people a little bit more information about where you're located, how they can find you, are you on social media? Yeah, so we have um, Instagram, Facebook. Um, we have like, it's called Frisky Ice Cream and Coffee. Okay. We also are located on uh, um, sh like Sterling Heights, Shader mm -hmm. and Canal Road, south of Lakeside Mall. Okay. Yeah. Nice, and you have like a nice little outdoor area. People can come and yeah. just kind of enjoy the summer and yeah. some fresh ice cream. Yeah, we try to make it where friends and family can come together and enjoy mm -hmm. something that they haven't experienced yet, so. I love it, nice. I love it. Well, thanks, Jessica. Well, thank you. Cheers, <laughs> cheers, back to you guys. 